वेलकम गाइस टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ कैमरा सेवन एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्पीक अबाउट अ टॉपिक व्हिच हैज़ बीन बर्गिंग मी फॉर मंथ्स एंड द थिंग इज दैट टू बी ऑनेस्ट आई एम बोर्ड ऑफ ओ टी टी प्लेटफॉर्म्स राइट नाउ आई एम बोर्ड ऑफ कॉन्टेंट आई एम बोर्ड ऑफ फिल्म एंड टी वी शोज राइट नाउ द रीज़न इज इट्स दे आर टू मच ऑफ कॉन्टेंट आई डोंट नो वॉट टू वॉच गाइज दिस इज लाइक द बिगेस्ट पैराडॉक्स ऑफ चॉइस आई हैव एवर हैड दिस वीकेंड आई सैट डाउन एंड वॉन्टेड टू वॉच सम फिल्म या टी वी शो आई स्पेंड वन आवर जस्ट डिसाइडिंग वॉट टू वॉच and after one hour when i selected the film i didn't like that so basically i wasted 2 to 3 hours just to know that i don't want to watch something because there's too much of content and there's too much confusion there's too much of platforms and it's also very expensive subscribing to all the platforms this is a big problem now uh you have amazon prime you have hotstar you have netflix you have uh apple tv you have uh, i don't know like sony live or i don't know like uh, i am talking about the indian ott space in us you have hulu and peacock hbo max and all the all other stuff uh so the this this problem of paradox of choice is rampant like to be honest like it's very hard to find good co- good content nowadays like it's very rare like the last film which i saw which which was brilliant and which was a i would say considered as good quality content is tune to and tune to is unique because that's not an ott so like you know when dune dune to is coming you will you are going to watch in the theaters so it's not so confusing you know that uh, in this year this film is going to come this one this sequel is going to come this is one of the best films getting made this century so we are going to watch it on uh, in, in a theater but for Uh, an uh, ott experience this is totally opposite in theaters you have limited number of good films you know yeah, yeah yeah i want to watch this film i want to watch this film so let's plan it out and yeah you go you enjoy and you are satisfied you you feel you have got your money's worth but for ott it's exactly the opposite the ott might be cheaper but at the same time you don't good value uh, uh that kind of like you get from a film or watching a film in a theater like uh the content quality in average has gone down so much nowadays that a lot of uh, films are just not worth watching uh, or tv shows and it's very hard to find out or know which tv show is good or which film is good because in the sea of average content the good ones get lost simple and and the otts uh, have been like bombarding us, us with average Uh, with low quality content it's low quality not in sense of video quality content but in sense of the script in sense of the actual f- film so it's very hard to find good quality content nowadays and even if you find one it's not on tvs it's not on televisions uh, sorry in on uh, cinemas it's like uh, there's no marketing for that good quality content like you you are not able to find it Uh, and uh, you might come across it but at the same time you might miss it so it's very difficult and this because of this confusion i've just stopped watching uh, otts like i watch very specifically which uh, tv shows i want to watch or which film i want to watch but i actually don't like watching otts nowadays i i actually prefer youtube because youtube at least i'm gaining knowledge at least i'm gaining something but on otts the in the sea of average content in the uh see of very mm, very like boring content and same time at uh, same type of scripts getting repeated in different variations like you uh, for example uh romance movies like they are in the same format in different versions in different settings like why would you do that like if you see uh, uh romcoms <laughs> or something like related to like romance you will see a boy girl okay in a college setting and then there is a office setting and then the same story like there's no variations there's no interesting uh, drama in it it's very boring like i miss the time when we used to have suits uh, you remember suits uh, oh my god this one of the best tv shows i have ever seen and uh, like that drama like 
in suits you hardly add any uh, any hi-fi scenes it's just a drama in a law firm it's basically that but it's it was so well written it was so well scripted like every uh, every episode was very interesting so it's not like that every content is bad nowadays like you have for example i like young sheldon young sheldon is one of the most well written content right now also we have uh, uh, the boys it's it's very unique it's very fun so yeah there's not like there's no uh, shows there are good shows but it's rare it's like in year you are getting two to three good shows for me at least and others are very average so uh, i'm just tired of this uh, low quality content uh, bombardment by the otts just because they want engagement day like they make anything what they can like they are just making content in uh, content in quality uh, quantity not in quality so and that is like harming the industry that is harming our perspective towards uh, films and televisions which is not good which is not good at all and with the uh, emergence of tiktok uh, shorts and deals our uh, attention span is also less nowadays so having a bad quality content also makes it worse because our attention span is less and watching bad quality content is more difficult than ever before so yeah i hope the ott platforms change their strategy change their techniques and their uh, bombard and they, and they stop bombard bombarding with very low quality content and uh, start investing in good quality content good quality videos good quality uh, films and televisions and actually then only they can gain a lot of more lot more subscribers they can gain loyal subscribers which they subscribe they actually subscribe monthly to them and i hope the ott platforms they now concentrate on actually bringing good quality content but in less quantity of course because if they concentrate on uh, quality uh, quantity and less in quality then they will lose the game they will lose the game in long run they won't they won't able to survive people will just find out another content from another place or another like platform and they will they will not uh, they are not going to gain loyal subscribers so i hope the ott platforms and the uh, netflix's amazon primes of the world they learn through uh, this uh, lesson that quality matters more than quantity and if you want engagement please produce good quality content yeah they do make some good quality content as i have given you the example like for the netflix there is stranger things there is uh, money heist there is like couple of shows uh, she you have a lot of shows in netflix and then in amazon you have the grand tour uh, the boys jack ryan um uh, uh marvelous miss mazel the so yeah it's not like they don't have good quality content but the content is so less that in the sea of the bad quality content they put in quantity it's it degrades the whole platform so yeah so i hope uh, any of uh, some of you might be working in netflix's or uh, amazon or disney please share this video with them please share this feedback because this paradox of choice will ultimately kill your business simple as that so i hope this message goes through uh, to the right people on on uh, to the right companies and they learn from it so guys thank you for watching and staying till uh, end of this video i know this is a little bit longer video it's kind of a rant video but it was very important for me to share this because i'm just tired i'm just tired of this uh, uh, this bombardment as you I, as i have see, uh, s said so yeah thank you guys thank you for watching and i will see you in the next video or the next rant bye